Hey, what's going on with it, uh, ladies and gentlemen? Ponies and Jones Calls is the one, the only. Criticism Guide 2009, aka Nintendo Free 2011. So, before I begin, real quick, I know I haven't done a face cam on video in a while. Like I said, I'm in the Nintendo Free 2011 channel. If any of you guys have subbed to me there, um, I've been doing a couple things in real life. You know, I'm not going to mention too much because it's going to get too personal. Hopefully, you can see that Pokemon thing in the background. You know, I actually did my Plasma Shadow thing a couple weeks ago. If you haven't checked that unboxing video out, definitely a badass one. Had something to do with Giratina, though, obviously. If any of you guys haven't seen this shit already, I'll give it a close-up. There he goes right there. He's a fucking boss. That's all I gotta say about that. So yeah, without further ado, let's begin. There's gonna be another alternative media video, so if you wanna be a sheeple, and get the fuck out. But if not, you wanna know the truth, and you don't wanna hear no lies, like Fox, CNN, CNN MSNBC, etc., all that shit, um, by all means, stay. So here we go. So yeah, today I'll be talking about Egypt's revolution. This isn't the first time this happens, you know, in my opinion, you know, it's good. You know, they stand up, they overthrow their leader, and uh, hopefully they give them better than one, even though the mainstream media, they're never going to cover that shit. But you know what? I'm going to cover it myself, because I know AMTV, they always cover that stuff. You know, you got Green Wave, he's awesome as shit. Definitely shout out to Christopher Green, he's an awesome boss. Yeah, anyways, um, the people are tired of fed up with their old leader because he was basically a dictatory or tyrannical bastard, in my fucking opinion, because he's a piece of fucking shit. I hope he does get shot and assassinated because death isn't too good for him. It's great for him. Because all these little dictatorial UK bastards, UN, the United Nations that control this world, they're just little pieces of scumbag fucks. That's all I'm going to say about that. The only two things I will say is that um, even if they have family and shit, hey, Hopefully their family's all safe, but you know what? As far as the person goes, the responsibilities as fathers is just complete fucking excrement. That's all I'm going to say about that. There's that. And then the second thing I really didn't like about it, though, is I like, hopefully they don't end up killing innocent civilians on standbys, like um, how like Obama does with his little drone strike. He just kills innocent women and children all over the place, and it's pretty fucking sad. And it, I guarantee you, World War III will happen. They're just going to sugarcoat it to a different word. So the mainstream sheep will be like, oh, like, oh, we need to do this. You know, we have to get in there and destroy other people's countries. And a lot of other countries, they really don't give a shit about us. They want us fucking dead in the ground, unfortunately. That's what I have to come down to. And I've seen Mexico a couple times. I've been there. And <laughs> some of them really hate fucking Americans. Even the Latino Americans, some of them, they really don't care. Others, they do give a shit, you know. It all comes down to patriotism. That's what it really comes down to. Because in my opinion, I'm going to put my two cents in it. It's just fucking shit, you know? The, the way they, the mainstream media just feeds us this bullshit. It's fucking sad, ridiculous, and it's downright fucking evil. I'm not even gonna sugarcoat that fucking shit because it is crap mierda to an extreme point where it just boils the blood of my fucking body. It just does. Other than that, the last thing I'll say about this, um, congrats to all the people that got their new freedom. Hopefully they're not under this tyrannical police state. I even heard France has an NSA out there, which is no surprise because a lot of people are getting fed the fuck up over there, and I feel their pain. I don't, I feel their pain, you know? I don't know any French, but I do know a little Espanol here and there, but I don't speak of that much. And, uh, yeah, hopefully there's not too many drone strikes and deaths out over there, because we leveled the crap out of Europe in World War One and World War Two, and it's fucking sad. And some of the great the grandparents or great-grandparents, they still hate America, and it sucks, you know? Say like Rodney King said, can't we all just get the fuck along, you know? He didn't say to get the fuck along, just get along. Uh, unfortunately, that's never going to happen, because as long as there's a devil in this world, and God's in this world, you know, that's never going to happen. But you know what? we got to stay positive, try to keep it real, and try to uh, live on a day-to-day -day basis of survival, you know, survival of the fittest, regardless of with the economy, or your own personal um, economy yourself, as entrepreneurship and everything goes. I know I'm getting off topic there, but there's even some of the rebels. I don't know if some of them are paid to do any of that, they're just blasting the shit out of everything, you know, just throwing all these hot cocktails like a boss, you know? I commend them for that, you know? Fight for your own fucking right and don't do anything what the fucking tyrannical government wants you to do. Oh, no, you gotta stay quiet and we don't want no interference. Fuck that interference. That's bullshit. You know? I'm calling that fucking bullshit right now. And this dude's got balls to be doing that shit, so I commend them for that. So hopefully they get killed the next day. But like I always say, like, comment, subscribe, all that good shit, and uh, is what it is, ain't what it ain't. See you when I see you. Guys, have a good day, have a good night, wherever you're at around the world. Um, don't drink or smoke weed at the same time, and don't do anything reckless, all right? Guys, be safe, be easy, and I'll talk to you soon, all right? Laters, goodbye. Peace the fuck out. I'm gone, and uh, have a good weekend.